Hi, my name's Joseph Gray, and I'm an artist and designer who lives in Seattle, Washington, and works with interactive technologies. Uh, what you're seeing launching up right here is a video mixing application that I wrote in processing that connects to this device called the Projbox. Hooked up to the video mixer is a webcam, and uh, I'm getting a view here of this device uh, that is being used as just kind of a generic controller for a bunch of software, um, it, or it's possible to use it for you know whatever kind of software that you end up writing. Uh, in this case, the video mixing application, which is being displayed on the screen. Um, one of the things um, to know about this device is that it's just basically a box with an Arduino in it and a bunch of uh, you know wires and knobs and stuff like that, uh, all attached to uh, a, connected to a breadboard. Um, I designed this because uh, basically I needed something that I could just like, you know, run some wires together, uh, you know, have some knobs and stuff on the outside, uh, you know, prototyping, you know, project box. So I got the name Proj Box. Uh, it ended up getting turned into a kit uh, that's now available on the Maker Shed um, from Make Scene and or the Make Scene runs, and that. Uh, is also used, it's featured in uh, a class that I taught uh, called Processing and Arduino in Tandem, uh, which teaches a lot about how to make applications in processing and then integrate them into, uh, integrate them with Arduino. And it uses this project box as an example application. So first thing that uh, this particular app can do, this video mixing app connected to the Proj box, uh, is this knob, as you'll see, when I start turning it, is going to uh, crossfade to a previously recorded video. So I just like turn it back and forth, and it crossfades. Uh, one of the other things this app can do is when you press the space bar and hold it down, it starts recording. Now this is pretty amazing that it's recording at all. Uh, you'll notice that the video quality is pretty chunky. Um, it's because I'm running a screen capturing application in the background that's also recording audio, uh, and this video mixer is also recording and displaying at the same time um, two different video, a live video stream and pre-recorded streams. All right, now I let go of that and you can go back here and look back at this thing. And uh, we switch back over to the pre-recorded video. Um, now we'll see what we had just recorded. Um, we can also, if I go back over to this live stream, uh, you can see how I can select between pre-recorded videos And then uh, if we select, go all the way back to the one that we just recorded, uh, one of the knobs, uh, you know, right now it's all the way stopped, but you can change its speed. It's going slow. You can change it to go fast, uh, or you can turn it all the way down to stop. And then one of the other knobs, which uh, I'll crossfade back up so you can see which one, this one, uh, allows you to scrub the video frames. So jump between uh, frames in the video from beginning to end. So that all said, there's also a bunch of switches on this Proj box. Uh, these are uh, in a configuration uh, right now, it's just going to do, it's kind of like what I call a classic mix, just a, in video uh, editing terminology, like an A-B linear mix it's between the pre-recorded channel and uh, the, live, the live channel. But this switch right here, if all, so all these three are already on, but this one's not on yet. Uh, if all four of them are on, it goes into what I call the funk mix which is a difference uh, blend mode, uh, kind of like what you would find in a 
graphics programs that use like you know opacity uh, layer effects like you know overlay and difference and saturation and that kind of thing uh, which this you know instantly creates a pretty cool you know effect um, that you know you could use to just kind of generate textures or, or what all uh, it looks really great projected that sort of thing so anyways that's uh, you know that's the long and the short of it there's the proj box and the video mix you know video mixing application together I want to say also that this is going to be featured in a supplement to the original processing in Arduino and Tandem course. Uh, the supplement is called uh, Video Mixer, and it's about how to make this video mixing application. Uh, and if you you know follow the original uh, five session course, it shows how to uh, build this as part of the class, but it also um, the, those in assembly instructions are also available online uh, at projbox.org and also uh, at Make Projects. Uh, so anyways, I want to say thanks for watching and hope you enjoyed. Uh, and have a good day.